Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is uh, barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of excitement and expectation. We are in the port city of Porto, and this unmistakably the Estadio do Dragao. Blue, certainly the colour. The crowd rises for the national anthem of South Korea. has got the juices flowing and now this They appear to be shaping up in a 4-4-2 formation. Reminders of a, a golden era in English football, I should add. And it continues to hold its place in the modern game. Playing a second striker runs the risk of being outnumbered in midfield, of course. So with the wider pairing and fullbacks, plenty of running has to be part of their play. And of course, the right service into the box. So we're up and running. Drives it towards the front. He can in. Tries to switch the play. Oh, sweet feet. That looks a good ball. And that's been levered clear. Uh, looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Just a talking to, I think. Yes, it is. of true class and he's produced a beauty South Korea have an early lead. Good start. Forward pass. Well, that's where he wants it. Lee Kang in. Son Hyung Min. Son Hyung Min. Saudi Arabia suffering an early setback, looking to reel it back in. Well, you can be very hard to regroup and work your way back into the match, but they've got time. Well, 
needed a better pass there. And here's the chance to counter. Tries to get it forward quickly. There's a lot of movement up front. Yeah, I have noticed that those uh, front players are working very hard, dropping deeper. Yeah, and I just think it keeps the opposition off guard with, with so much switching of position. Keeping shape is, is much harder. Plays it long. Towards the front line. Saleh Javier really got caught in a trap there and he just couldn't get out. A buccaneering run from the defender. Now it's Son Hyung Min. Son Hyung Min. Son Hyung Min plays it backwards and they'll try again. And it's been given away. Chance to break. Here it comes. Good take by the keeper, he's read that well. Lee Kang in, a scorer already in the game. Saudi Arabia are trailing here with the first half almost done. Oh, that's nice. Plenty waiting in the middle. Lee Kang In. He's in space and looking for options. And it's hoisted clear. Hoists it forward. Ball is over the line. And it's played forward. Good challenge. Excellent challenge. And there's the end of the first half. And there we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. So off we go once more. Saudi Arabia need to get the balance right to sort this out. Ambition must be complemented by just the right amount of caution, and I think the more experienced players can oversee that. Tries to locate someone up front. Out to the right. And it's got through. Knocks it away. Forward it goes. it out and it's played forward just brushed off the ball there 
And now they can launch a counter. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No. It's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. That is terrific skill. And he's cut it out. Tries to get it forward quickly. Well, this is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Just has to be done. Hoists it forward. Oh, well defended, that had to be done. So, Jim, what are you thinking? Saudi Arabia are now matching their opponents blow for blow, despite the scoreline. No shrinking violets out there. Li Kang in. Lee Kang In's cross. They didn't manage to get nearly enough into the box, and that speaks of little ambition. And it's Son Kyung Min. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? it out to the wing whipped in and he's there to cut it out Peter they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver or the knockout blow. Either way, it's got to happen right away. Well, it's looking like too little too late, but they are giving it all they have. That's gone a long way up and away. Saudi Arabia are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. Uh, the ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. He's in, surely! He's going for goal! No mistake! They have stolen level at the last! Now looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. And when the manager called on him, he was only too happy to repay that case. Well, the instruction from the manager would have been go on and make yourself a nuisance and see if you can snatch a goal. Mission accomplished. All square again. And 90 minutes are up, 30 more to come. Well, I don't think either manager can have any complaints, really, because nobody quite pushed for the winning goal, and it always lacked that spark. So 90 minutes, couldn't produce a winner. Into extra time we go. Saudi Arabia did fantastically well to force extra time, having been on the brink of defeat in normal time. In fact, you could say they're the better off of the two teams, at least psychologically. That's got paid to a promising move. Forward it goes. Has he found his man? Promising move, that. Good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Hoists it forward. Plays it out to the flank.
And it's played forward. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Gets away from his opponents. Over hits and out of play. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. it for the first half of extra time well there's plenty of potential for a final and so the last chance to find a winner this has been enthralling so what the last 15 minutes have left that always looked inevitable the defense dealt with that really well Lee Kang In. Lee Kang In is on to it and can take it up. Oh, that is lovely footwork. And he has been fouled there. The referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket. It's just a stern lecture. has got rid of that tries to get it forward quickly breaks on here now the ball's come loose and the chase is on you wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. Played out to the right. Takes it over to the other flank. And that's it. Nothing to separate them. It is penalties. Look, I've been in this position myself, and after a grueling game, you don't want to back down if... The manager asks you to take the penalty for fear of appearing weak. Boy, you can feel the tension. So, the first penalty. Puts the one out. He was always looking good there. Nice penalty. Oh, no. Oh, I feel for him. It looked like placement precision. Saudi Arabia have the chance to pull away here. It's in. Too smart for the keeper. And they're two up. South Korea can't afford to miss another one. Oh, what a save! Well, that's a super save from the keeper. And so the captain steps up. Great stop. Keeper's denied him. That's a lovely stop from the keeper. He's got his teammates proud with that one. South Korea trailing by two now. Good penalty, completely wrong foot of the keeper. Saudi Arabia with this chance to pull two clear. Oh, it's saved, pretty much straight at him. 
I think the tension must have got to him because that went straight into the keeper's arms. Oh, he saved it! Oh, the keeper's done brilliantly to keep his eye on the ball and makes it a great save. This one to win it. And he delivers! Shootout winners. It is such a compelling way to win. Compelling and cruel. But they were so composed under pressure, and that was the difference. Well, there's really nothing quite like the excitement of a penalty.